Well, welcome back to another episode. We've come down from north and we've started our journey towards the east coast back to pick our van up. But um, this place is called Mary Kathleen. And uh, it's an abandoned little um, mining town and it's a free camp set up just east of Mount Isa. And um, there's a, cool f a few cool little things to do around here. So. Uh, we're gonna go check them out, but Alenia got us into camp yesterday and um, it was a pretty cool little sunset around the fire, so I'll, I'll show you some of those clips. Alenia's getting us into camp today and um, no doubt she's talking smack in the camera in the car. Today, Nick is very picky and we've moved like 10 million times already, but now I've told him I'm moving, so I'm moving the van. I've learned or we've learned, sorry, it's orientation is best to face west. So our kitchen is facing east. So in the afternoon, you get the shade. At the hottest part of the day up here, you get the shade in the afternoon, which is what she wants. Um, yeah, anyway. Get us in, doll. Look, she'll be waiting for, for me to tell her where to go. I've been looking after the kids because one is right here. Oh, oops. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is it? Oh, he's over there. He's all the way over there. Finny! What are you doing? <laughs> She's going to put it right under a tree so we don't get any solar. Finny, you stay here. Well, she's gone past the tree. A little bit further. Whoop! <laughs> uh, I think that'll do us. Oh, they've got a baby. Why is he a bull? Oh, he's got balls. He does. I can see him dangling from here. It's like our families have had a big fight. Lennox is over there. Finney's here. Big Mum is smashing some leftover KFC. Here we go, aren't you? I can't be bothered cooking. I sleep and like a child. So luminous and vibrant. I'm always in. Mary Kathleen was pretty well like the, this township or abandoned township built around a mine which was discovered in 1954 and worked all the way until 1982 and um, it was a uranium mine and when the mine ceased operation they took they auctioned off all the houses and everything and um, a lot of them went to Mount Isa and Cloncurry and apparently they're still in use today but it even had a swimming pool, uh, like a cinema, everything. When they were uh, like building the township, they completed a house per day. That's pretty. Um, that's pretty good, especially for back then. Stop boring people. <laughs> Did you hear that? That that's what I've got to deal with. This. Mine site, sick Rio Tinto needs to fix their um, infrastructure. <laughs> <laughs> So it is a little bit of a forward drive track up to the uh, 
um, mine site, but it's pretty cool. It sort of waves through the uh, weaves um, through the through the mountains. Carrying the drone, are you, little fella? <laughs> well, we're here. We just got a little short walk down this path, and we should be there. Beautiful. What do you reckon, Lennox? <laughs> <laughs> do you want to swim? Yeah. Why not? There's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue There's a lot of colors Lost within a haze Don't rely on others To get you through the maze there's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue Worth the coming, darling? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, like, it'd be pretty... I don't know what's in the water down there. It's like a little fish or a duck or something. <laughs> but um, it'd be like, I don't know, back in the day, like they've cut a lot of earth out. Benny's happy with himself. He's We're relieved moving. now. Oh. <laughs> Pit Lennox, what happened to Minmon? Pooed itself. <laughs> Pooed itself. It went everywhere. So gross. Anyway, let's go back to camp. So, I'm showing you a bit of behind the scenes action of Elenia's cooking show. She's having a sleep and she's told me to put a brisket on so she can do a cooking show in the afternoon. Typical, eh? Nah, just kidding. She's um she's growing a kid so she has every right to have a sleep. So I'm gonna put this brisket on. It's um eleven o'clock and then by the time she gets up and the boys get up, um this is gonna cook for like six or seven hours. So it should be perfecto. We have surfaced. We have, and we're ready to go. Oh. And I'm making a cool Milo with Lenny. Hey, Lenny, tell us how it is. <laughs> Big boy. I'm into it. Did you um, count so we're all fair? Doesn't look like it, mate. I've just smashed them in there. <laughs> <laughs> we went shopping yesterday in Mount Isa, and you can tell because we have food. Ooh. We're just about to rub a bit of meat too. <laughs> well, Lenya is. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm doing. As usual. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. Thanks. Let the real chef take over. <laughs> right, oh. What is even this? <laughs> oh, it's brisket. We're gonna have brisket burgers. And look, I was kind. I let Nick cook the brisket because he's been really wanting to do it. Thanks for that. You're welcome. No worries. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know how to cook it. You did a great job. But now, I'm ready to rub me meat. You gotta be nice and um, rough, but yet so gentle. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm doing. All right, now wrap him up. To go back into the fire. And I'll give this to me a little man slave. I've done the hard work. If you don't have a man slave, you need to get one. You 
learning from the best here. Yeah. Hey, quick! <laughs> <laughs> We put a kids movie on in under the van and look who's the only one watching it. Who's the movie for? <laughs> uh, the kids. <laughs> <laughs> what are you watching? Garfield. Oh, classic. <laughs> While I wait for me, um, brisket to cook. So, I've done the hard bit. Chopped up a bit of salad. <laughs> Not much to the salad. Lettuce, cheese and onion and we got a bit of mayo but we want to keep it as simple as possible because we want to taste the meat and the flavouring. Tiger buns with a bit of butter, healthy butter and yeah we're just gonna put them together. Oh just falling apart, no need to cut it down. As usual, not bad, not bad at all. This camp was an awesome camp. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool. And for free. Um, just, I reckon it's worth noting, um, like, take your rubbish, don't be stupid in places like this, otherwise they end up shutting them. Yeah. Yeah. But what, where are we going to? We are going to Julie Creek. And I may have booked something for tonight, but the weather was a bit crappy this morning, so I'm hoping it clears up and I get to do what? something that's been on my bucket list. Stop for a wee break and... Oh, <laughs> and have a look at the big crack in the windscreen now. We've gone like, I don't know, like two, three months out on like corrugated rocks, like dirt roads, and we come back on tar for a couple of weeks and this is what's happened. What's the moral of the story, boys? Don't drive on tar. <laughs> so it's the first time we plugged this van in uh, in about a month or so and it doesn't really need to be plugged in we're just doing it because uh, we've paid for it there's no unpowered sites here is that right no no unpowered yeah so everyone watch <laughs> Ooh, the van didn't blow up we're all right <laughs> what are you doing now got a surprise for you guys <laughs> yeah. what are we doing lennox Riding a bike. <laughs> Where? Into town. Yes. <laughs> We're going on an adventure. Yes. I haven't rode a bike in God knows how long, so this could be fun. Let's go. Yes. Let's go. Oh God. <laughs> She's a bit wobbly. Oh God. Oh God. Mom. How's Mum going, Lennox? Where are you? Here. <laughs> Here, Mum. Is mummy a bit wobbly? No. Oh, I'm good, am I? Whoa, we're riding in town. What are we going to get? No. We have no money. Cheese and Vickies. Cheese and Vickies. Why? What are we doing tonight? Eating a bath. Yep, we yeah. are. We're going to have an artesian bath. Yes. I wanted to do it, and we didn't do it last time we were here in Julia Creek, which was a few years ago now. But, um, yeah, anyway, we're going, me and my little mate, we're going shopping. Yeah. Woohoo! It's a big ride, isn't it? So you can hire these bikes out from, or hire them, wet their free of charge, but you can take the bikes out from the caravan park here at Julia Creek and just ride into town. Let's go and drop this bike back. It's a pretty good adventure. <laughs> You're a weapon, eh? <laughs> How'd mum go? Did you beat her? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was super fast. And was mummy a bit wobbly? Uh, um, no, you wouldn't be wobbly on a bike. Very wobbly. <laughs>
Oh, big boy wants a guy. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh Nick hates me cutting cheeks, by the way. Because oh. <laughs> of that. See what Nick thinks of my beautiful platter. I'm just going to blame the knife because it's not very sharp. I got olives, by the way. So that's as fancy as we're going to get. And this is my gourmet cheese platter. What does everyone think of my platter? That's a ripper, eh? Ooh, marshies. <laughs> Did you like it? Yeah. That's pretty good with a um, platter on a budget. <laughs> I fed by bore, um, artesian bore water, which is um, warm, and that's your view. And we've come for the sunset one, you can book um, certain times, and we book the sunset, so hopefully we'll see some sort of sunset out there, but I don't think it's going to matter, you're already smiling. No, it's not. It's going to get a nice photo, <laughs> to remember it. I think this might be the boys' bath, and then that's our bath. <laughs> We're gonna sit down here and you can just watch us. That's, that sounds a bit weird, doesn't it? <laughs> you watch us having a bath. <laughs> I don't know when the last time I heard silence was. So I'm just gonna sit here. I have 10 minutes to myself and sit here. How's that for a sunset? All right, good night guys. <coughs> Julie Creek has got another um, free camp and we're just down here now. So if you don't wanna stay in a caravan park, if you love free camping like we normally do and you're not doing the baths it's right on the river it's it's a pretty cool spot um 96 hours is it yeah 96 stay. hours you can stay um we're not going to stay here tonight because um, we're heading east we're moving, on. We're moving on but um yeah i mean it's an option <laughs> We spent the next few days travelling through the towns of outback Queensland, just putting into perspective just how big this country is. You can't help yourself, can you? Before ending up at Charters Towers to celebrate our little Lennox's third birthday. Movie time! Mm -hmm. Dive in movies at Charters Towers. Yeah, we're gonna park right at the front so no one can see past the boat. <laughs> no, <not. laughs> one, two, three, Nunu's birthday! Nunu's birthday! Woohoo! Should we go and get some popcorn and lollies? Yes. He has not stopped talking. <laughs> Just go, go, go. Oh, blankie, yeah, we'll get a blankie in a minute. We'll go and get some num nums first. Mm -hmm. Let's do this. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. That's what birthdays are good for. Mm. <laughs> 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 Lennox, look at that big one. Wow. Do you want a bit of cream? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> How good are birthdays? Special thanks to all of our Patreons for your ongoing support. It helps us to continue to share our travels with you all through our weekly episodes. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and we'll see you all next week. Thanks for watching. <laughs>